this is Yahoo Answer. It was sent in by Ira Ray. Thanks, Ira. It's by Yahoo Answers user No Name. Uh, sorry? Sorry? Are you Ira Ray? Thank you. Who wants to thank know? Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, no Name asks, is it acceptable to wear a Snuggie in church? Have you ever seen anyone wearing a Snuggie in church? Do you wear one? If I went to church, I think it would be nice to snuggle up in the pew with your Snuggie and Bible. They should make them in religious theme prints for that purpose. I know somebody who wears a Snuggie to church. Who's that? Uh, maybe you've met him. He's called the Pope. <laughs> <laughs> Pope's been wearing a Snuggie for all of his papal days. Yeah. And no one's called him out on it yet. He's infallible and he's unsnuggleable. He's so comfortable. I think I think when you're wearing a Snuggie, you are literally the snuggliest you could ever be. But what if ooh, what if they made a – I just had a great idea to, like, facilitate snuggling. What if you had a Snuggie, uh-huh. but it went, around, it went around your entire body, and you could even get fun with it and, like, make it, like, the shape of an animal? Wait. Mm, don't Snuggies already go around your entire body? No, no, your hands and your face. And instead of a face, you would have, like, a wolf's – like, a sexy wolf face. You're talking about a furry <laughs> – no, I think what he's suggesting no, no, no. Is I t- I'm talking about like a full body, full body snuggy costume. suit with animal with animal uh, skin. Okay. So you dress up as an animal and go to church, basically. That's basically what I'm saying. That's basically okay. what I'm saying. We have, listen. We have come out in full support of basically every imaginable type of subgroup of people ever. Right. Uh-huh. So I'm not knocking. I'm not knocking furries. I swear to you. <laughs> but is there a furry church? <laughs> but okay, because here's my point. I I love steampunk. Mm-hmm. I don't want to see you know Doctor Laserbeam rolling up uh, to church <laughs> with his girlfriend and her parasol mm-hmm. and talk about hey Zoo. You know what I mean? Like time and place, people. Time this, and place. I'm changing churches unless you make Zeppelin parking. <laughs> <laughs> Where am I supposed to leave it? It's a giant balloon. <laughs> this is my steam powered praying machine. <laughs> no one. <laughs> You put your wish into this canister. If I, I would shoot you, sir, if I wasn't out of water. <laughs> um, Travis, where does your zealotry end? If I can't steampunk in church, can I wear shorts? Am I allowed to wear shorts to your church? You know, it's funny you asked that, but it gave me really strong shivers to picture it. Yeah. Not in my church. Maybe some of those... Lucer Northern Baptist Church. Yeah, I guess that's, it, I didn't think about but that. But in my church, full suits of armor. Is there a furry church? We didn't answer the question. I guess oh. we have to answer the first to answer the question if there's a furry heaven and hell. Well, yes. It's in a regular heaven and hell. <laughs> I guess that's true. I want to go to furry church now. I want to go to furry heaven. But let's <laughs> let's get back to Snuggies. Because I feel like we've made Justin uncomfortable. I think Justin's left. I think Justin might have switched the nozzle. He might have flipped a flanger. Oh, I'm still here. Ugh. What happened? My cat took a dump in here and I'm dying. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to like listen to this goof and pick back up on the goof. And like I'm trying to also light a sense. No, let's it fucking stick. This is important. Is it the oh. cat that you have? That is approximately three apples long, or is it the <laughs> six hundred pound sea cow with furry legs? Is it fatty catty or is it nervous Nelly? I'm gonna say it's the skinny one because they got it. It was like a stealth mish. <laughs> they got in and out, and I didn't. I didn't get them until the, I started getting them in my old factories. Oh god. <laughs> it's so gnarly in here. I have to find a candle. Say something funny. <laughs> Um, oh Christ! I mean, everybody, everybody who in their choir robes, which I'm assuming is at this church, because if you mm-hmm. if your choir's not wearing robes, what are you even doing there? Jesus can't right. hear the singing if they're not wearing robes. Um, I sprayed some Old Spice Fiji body spray. <laughs> oh God! It's getting a little better. Oh no, it's getting worse. <laughs> <laughs> they're blending. Stop. They're blending. Stop oh. doing aerosol alchemy. Can you not? <laughs> oh, it smells like physical therapist and and cat food in here, and I hate it. Um, like Jim Bro. Let's see the next question. 
Okay. Oh, I got a question. How do you get the cat poopy smell out of your office well, when you're trying to do comedy? This is a really good idea. The room in your house that you work out of and spend most of your time, maybe don't <laughs> Don't put, let your animal shit Maybe in don't it. put a like, shit receptacle for any living being in it. Well, you have full control over where that shit occurs. It all started because I, I had to keep the little one locked in here to keep her separate from the big one. So mm -hmm. I would put the, the dookie box in here. <laughs> And then I thought, but then I realized like I should move it out of here because I'm in here. Yeah. But then like I'm so worried is like the cat like Amelia will be like, well, I always stay here before. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Sorry, you didn't have that magic dirt. <laughs> I'm a cat. Oh, fuck. Come on, Hemingway, you're my favorite <laughs> sensei. Don't let me down now. <laughs> let the smooth blend of of sandalwood and fucking cherries wash over me and save me from this. I don't oh, think that's what Hemingway smelled like. I'm, gonna... I'm trying so hard, Justin. <laughs> Hemingway probably smelled like probably like pipe smoke and boner cream. Save me, Papa. 